So can the Hillsborough County Public School community help fix the district's budget shortfall? A newly formed finance advisory committee held a second meeting about that tonight. Justin Shecker reports the budget is running about $70 million in the red. Junior Fund counts for all the financial resources that we cannot pay out of any other fund. The 15 person Hillsborough Schools Finance Advisory Committee listened to a detailed presentation from the CFO on the district's $3.3 billion budget. I think trust is, is central to see that we're being transparent. Ellen Lyons represents the Hillsborough County PTA. We want to find solutions that don't involve extreme teacher cuts or loss of. Uh, personnel or students to the district. Some school board members point out the state of Florida's funding per pupil is well below the national median. And now the district is losing state dollars because more students are transferring to private schools or enrolling in charter schools. When a large portion of a school goes to a charter or uses a scholarship, a family empowerment or McKay scholarship, uh, that means that there's less kids that are in the school, but the operational costs for the school are still mostly the same. And so that does create problems. The committee chair proposed taking a closer look at the bus driver shortage and whether the district has an appropriate staffing model. I have great hope that the committee is going to take a very um, concerted effort to understand the finances, to understand exactly what's causing these deficits, and to solve them. Justin Shecker, eight on your side.